Hey YouTube, Nerdy Nerf here again with another Nerf review slash mod. Today it will be a mod, not a review. Um, how to make your Maverick turret a CPVC. How do you CPVC it? So here's what I'm going to do. I've already took out all the screws. First thing you want to do is get this thing off. It would naturally be right here. Or going through it actually. You take that off. Now what I've done to this is I have the original spring and then I have the uh another spring that I just had laying around and that right there helps make the turret turn better. It sits right there like that. Right there, right there, and it makes the turret turn better. Now that's how I've modded that. Now to get this out is you pull this, this right here, and then this cap will come off, and the whole the rod and the, the the cap and this spring will come off, and the rod will pull out of the front. Now another thing, back to the CPC barrel material. Oh, uh, what you have to do is you have to take out all the screws. You have three in the front, one. Two, three, and in the back you'll have three. One here, one here, and the one here. Once you take out all of those, you should have three parts. One, which is the back. Two, which is the chamber. And three, which is this. And if you haven't prepared it to be CPVC'd, it should look like this. And it should have all of the things poking out. Now, originally, you'd slide your darts in this way. And they'd slide through like that right there. Now, if you can see those round things in there, this would slide on this way and it would look like that and then this piece would have an air restrictor cap in it and it would go on like this and then this piece would touch this piece that's essentially how it would work but I've prepared mine already so no air air restrictor caps. Um, no barrels, and by doing that, mine is prepared to be CPVC, CPVC, because it is a springer and it needs to be tighter. Now, the I main idea of the CPVC would be that the CPVC would stick it down into this right here. Then it would run its course throughout the rest of the chamber. Then it would run into this cap. So essentially it would look like this right here. With this in between it. So it would be like... Essentially, it would look something like this. Well, it wouldn't look like this. This piece here would be inside of here, and this piece would be inside of here, and if you were to pull this back, then the orange piece would still be inside of here, but you get the idea. And by cutting the, those parts off, and cutting all the extra barrels off the CPVC can go inside like this right here of course it'll go inside of here then it'll go through those rings and then it and then it will go inside of here so originally 
it'll be something like that with this in between here and here. Ah, oh, damn. I just broke one of my barrels. Oops, I said a bad word. My bad. I've already done this. Uh, this is my second time redoing this video, and I'm not doing it again just because I said a bad word. Anyway, it would be something like this right here. It'd look like this. CPVC, you know, inside of the the Maverick turret. So anyway. I believe that's all I have to show you, so I'll be letting y'all go now. Um, just an idea for... Busby Double Shot had to think about it. Take the Maverick barrels like this and just glue them inside of the original shells. It gives it a nice little look, so yeah. And plus it'll work with shoe knives. Alright, talk to you later next time. Nerdy Nerf, see you next video.